The subclavian artery continues below the clavicle as the axillary artery, accompanied by the axillary vein, travels parallel to it. The brachial plexus accompanies these vessels on their route to the axilla. The brachial plexus trunks divide and group to form three cords that are disposed around the axillary artery. These are the lateral cord, which travels cranial to the artery, the posterior cord that travels posterior to the artery, and the medial cord, which travels closer to the vein. The vein travels caudate to the artery. The neurovascular bundle lies on the chest wall medially and in the fatty tissue closer to the apex of the axilla. The neurovascular bundle is covered by pectoralis minor and pectoralis major ventrally. The musculocutaneous nerve takes off from the lateral cord at the level of the coracoid process. On the chest wall, note the long thoracic nerve, which sometimes is stimulated if the block needle is advanced too far, resulting in contractions of serratus anterior.